Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. Let's take one second to listen to all the amazing sounds that God has given us today. Do you guys hear it? There's wind. There's birds. There's the pitter patter of Ruby's little feet as she races down to the barn in the mud. It is glorious out today, you guys. Just beautiful. It's warm. Windy, and it's supposed to rain, but it is warm. Don't even need my mitts. All right, Ruby. Let's do it, girl. I'm so glad to have Ruby. In retrospect, in retrospect, our three chihuahuas that we have, not a good idea for farm life. What was he thinking? I'll tell you what I was thinking. I was thinking that I had two little teeny tiny girls, a one year old and a three year old. They loved dogs and they loved being able to like dress them up and play with them and yeah, then they grew out of that because now they're farm girls. Hi girly, hello. Hi Gracie. Hi Sky. Life will be changing for you soon, maybe. Our boys are coming home, and maybe you'll make a good match for Chino. You'll have a boy to hang out with, a real horse, not just some ponies. Does purple seem like yours? Yep, matches your water bucket. And you, my love, are temporarily blue. Oh God, I can never get this thing undone. Back it up. I love that Willow loves to cook. She's like such a good cook. This is Willow's hay stew. She makes it every single night. She never used to do that. I don't know if it's a winter thing or if I'll be anxious to see when the vet comes to do their spring check if her teeth need to be done. But she doesn't seem, she seems to be in great health. She's maintaining a good weight, so I don't think it's too serious. Or it could just be that she loves wet food. Anyway, it's your turn. And you, my love, are pink. You are pink. Today I'm down here doing chores all by myself and I'll tell you why. It's because today is the day that I'm gonna pull off the biggest surprise of life. You guys know Gabby never lets me surprise her and she's not gonna let me surprise her this time. I think this surprise is gonna be such a huge shock that she's not gonna be able to like fake that she's not surprised. I think she's gonna be surprised. So this is huge, you guys. I know and Sam knows that is it. You're the only people, oh, Sophie knows. Sophie knows and Kaylee knows. Sam and me and Sophie and Kaylee, we are the only people who know this surprise in all of the world. Actually, Fiona knows and Brandon knows too. So just me and Sam and Kaylee and Sophie and Fiona and Brandon and all the people at the tax store, like all the employees at the tax store, yeah. Yeah, those are all the people that know. We've been keeping this secret for the longest time, and as you can tell, I'm not that good at keeping secrets. Oh, my friend Allie knows too. Jeez, Laura, you have a big mouth. So a few people know the secret, but one thing is true, you guys don't know, at least until now you haven't known. Today, I'm gonna pull off the biggest surprise of Gabby's life. <laughs>
that was terrifying. That was freaking terrifying. My heart was racing, even though I was trying to keep it under control. I'm like, it's okay, Sky. Help, help. I was like second guessing. I was second guessing my choice to come down here by myself. The separation from the ponies for Sky has been hard. I get it because she's young and she needs a leader. One of the benefits of bringing our boys home though is gonna maybe be that she can go out there with Chino. So that's gonna, so hopefully that'll work out or else Fiona will take her home. I don't know, I haven't really talked to her about it, but I will be because she definitely needs more than a couple of little ponies across the fence. telling you guys about this down at the bar because I don't want anybody to know except for all the people that already know <laughs> anyways I don't want Gabby to know because no she's so good at figuring out if I'm acting weird if something different is happening like she can figure things out so this is all a big secret so so I have been planning this surprise since December I think it's been since December this has been a surprise I've been planning since December and Gabby does not even suspect even for a minute so this is the plan we are going to be taking Gabby to a place to look at something. We are going to be taking Gabby to the place where she's going to get this big huge surprise. And I'm going to tell Gabby that Fiona is sending us to this place because she because the people are selling a saddle. I've been looking for a saddle for Gracie for our grandkids. And You guys are just so distracting and beautiful. Okay, now after that distraction, okay, so we're gonna, so I'm gonna pretend that Fiona messaged me and said, hey, there's a saddle, blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna say to Gabby and Kaylee and Sophie, hey, uh, Fiona told me there's a saddle for sale. We're gonna go look at it. It's really cheap. We might be able to get it for Gracie. And then we're gonna go there and that's where it's all gonna go down. So stay tuned, because it's about to go down. Actually, it's not about to go down, because we're gonna finish the rest of this day. It's gonna happen at the end of the day. So stay with us until it goes down. And don't skip ahead, because something fun might happen today besides the surprise. And pause the video right now and comment below if you think we're gonna get to pull it off or if you think she's gonna guess. Comment below, pull it off or guess, and then start the video again. I'll wait for you guys. Okay, I'm going back up to the house. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. I'm home! I think there's no sleep. 
Oh. Get my boots. Something you have to show me? Is it scary? No. Is it exciting? You want to his birthday present. You hid it under my bed? You're acting suspicious. What? This day is getting really creepy. I ordered a subscription box for Gabby for her birthday. She's in her room. I have to be quiet. I ordered a subscription box and it never came and I thought it was a scam. They just keep taking money out of my account but they never send the product. Then I try to cancel it and they won't let me cancel it and it's just gonna keep renewing. It's a horrible subscription box. And then today it showed up and it is to go with the surprise. This is it. This is it you guys. This is a miracle. I saw first. It is lunchtime. Gabby and Kaylee are just getting out of bed. This is our last visit with Kaylee because uh, we're gonna be going into lockdown, social distancing, we're taking it seriously. This is our last day. Do you want fruit to go with your grilled cheese? No. No thank you? That's the way it happens in this house? No thank you? Wait, Gabby, Fiona found a saddle, a really good saddle for Gracie. She said that her friend is selling it. We can stop by tonight on our way to drop off Kaylee and check it out. You in? Greasy saddle. Don't look at Kaylee. She'd be looking rough. She just got out of bed too. I, I love your don't look riding at her pants. When, it's, when, when the camera's right just, there. I know, but they can close their eyes. I do that, you know. Like, if there's something in my videos that I don't want other people to see, I like avert my, my eyes. I look away. So for lunch today, the girls, Sophie's having, Kaylee's having soup. The girls are having grilled cheese. And I am having, what is this called, Kaylee? No, the soup your dad made. Uh, seafood chowder. Seafood chowder. Kaylee's dad made it. Mm, it's the best. It has bacon. I don't know if this one has bacon in it, but it's so good. Oh yeah, it's got bacon. It looks hot. Mm, it's so good. Let me show you. Like this is a big meal. This is what people who cook make. <laughs> bacon and potatoes and vegetables and mussels. Like Gabby would die if she knew there was mussels in this. I should give her one. Kaylee's having uh, Mr. Noodle Soup. Do you want blueberries, raspberries? Raspberries! Okay, so we are, Sam's on his way home from work soon and we're gonna go and check out a saddle before we drop Kaylee off. Uh, if you guys don't know, we've been looking for a saddle for Gracie and um, Fiona messaged me and told me that she found one that might work. So we have to have a code word though. Gabby, put your phone down and pay attention for a second. Okay, so Gabby, while well, you eat a bucket of candy that you're not supposed to have. Okay, so what's our, our secret code word? Like, what do I, like, I don't want to go there and be like, oh, I love it, let's buy it. And then you'd be like kicking me, like, I hate it, let's get out of here. Like, what are we going to use for a code word if it's not a good saddle? Like, what should we do? How are we going to do this? You're going to pull my hair? Yeah. Gabby's like, yeah, I'll pull your hair. Okay, what are we going to do? Gabby, you're the one that's experienced, you and Kaylee, on um, what the saddle is supposed to be like. What are we going to do? What time is it? Four. We're going to be there at four. What time is it? Oh, that's what you're going to say? What time is it? Echo. If you don't like it, you're going to say, what time is it? That's because we have to take Kaylee home. Or we could be okay. like, do you think the saddle would fit Echo? And then Echo, and then we'd be like, oh, darn. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> or you just run out the door. If one person starts walking away, we all come. Oh, okay, what about if I just say, okay, do you guys think this will fit? But no, wait, you can't You can't get a saddle on, on that because you have to try it. <laughs> all right, so if you guys hate it, say, hey, Mom, what time is it? And then I'll be like, okay, we pass. No, we have to bring Kaylee home soon. So if okay. we check her phone, we have to bring Kaylee home soon. All right, so if, okay, I get to take the vlog with us to check out the saddle. So, if, so we're going to be watching. If they whip out their cameras or their phones, if they whip out their phones, then we know it's a no. They don't want the camera or they don't want the saddle. We're gonna get if they whip out their phones suddenly, they both, all three of them are whipping out their phones, I'm going to be like, oh my gosh, let's get the heck out of here. Okay, so we're, we're just getting ready to go right now. What do you think is going to happen? I feel like she might cry, but at the same time, she's going to be like, I knew it. But really. You think she's going to cry? Maybe. Gabby would never cry on camera. Ever. Do you think she's going to pretend like she knew? Yeah, but yeah. she's not going to know. She's not going to know. It's going to be a shock of a lifetime. 
and she's gonna pretend and her dad is the same way every time I ever told him I was pregnant I'd be like trying to make it a surprise and he'd be like yeah I already she's knew going. hey you guys we are here right, watch your head oh they have chickens, oh, they have chickens. <laughs> 